YouTube. We are out here today at Quiet Creek, which is a tributary of the Potomac. Today we're going to be targeting some snakeheads actually and try to catch some bass too. But main objective today is to at least catch a couple snakeheads. Um, I really didn't target them that much last year and it was like one of the things for this year that's kind of on my bucket list. Also with this video, I just want to give a quick shout out to New Canoe. They are actually the brand of my kayak and I currently own the Frontier 12. And here recently, last week, last Thursday to be exact, to announce on their Facebook page, I'm actually a Team New Canoe member now for the um, Southern Atlantic region. I absolutely love how stable this kayak is. I mean, it lets me stand and fish all day and I get to control my trolling motor with uh, my foot pedal actually down here on the floor. And also I wanted to do a quick shout out to ProNav. Um, I've never really talked about them before, but the ProNav Angler is actually how I spot lock and also control my trolling motor with my phone. I'll leave a link in the description below for ProNav Marine. Just wanted to do a quick shout out to them. Hopefully we can get on some snakeheads today and catch some fish and just have a good day of fishing. I'm not in a tournament right now, so today's just kind of a fun day just to fish. So stay tuned. All right, so currently right now it is actually high tide. So it's high tide until noon. Um, then it's gonna switch out to low tide. So then we'll just switch over to a different area. But for right now, I'm gonna work this little area right here. And let's just see if we can catch some fish. I'm gonna start the morning off with a frog and just start by walking the dog with the frog. It's a little popper frog. Um, it's a smaller frog because I'm hoping that some snakeheads will bite this. Since they have a little bit smaller of a mouth, depending on how big they are um, versus a bass, it gives you a little bit better of a hookup ratio. I'm throwing this frog actually on the Arc Sniper. It is a heavy action rod, seven foot six. And it's just a little hollow body live target frog. Nope. One hour later. Nope. He just short struck me. Getting hot. This jig literally goes through anything. Ooh. Ooh, it ain't gonna go through that.
There we go. Oh, that might be what we're looking for. Nope. Oh, yeah, it is. Nope. No, this is a really, really, really big freaking large mouth. <laughs> oh. Nice. Thought for a second the way it was fighting it was a snakehead, but nope. It was just a Potomac brute. Go ahead and get a length on this one. Come here, girl. Yeah, she's not happy. All right. All right. Nope. She's <laughs> All right. She just wants to swim away from me. <laughs> Come here. There we go. They're like dogs. When you first put them on leashes, they kind of just want to fight you. Then I'm just eventually just give in. Yo, <laughs> yo, 16 and a half inches. All these fish are pretty much, uh, they're shorter and typically just well fed and kind of stocky. So let's see if we can get on some more. Let's let her go. All right, I think I'm gonna move up to where the creek is. Instead of being out here on this big old flat. That was either a snakehead or a bass. I can't tell. I think it was a snakehead. It was something. It was monstrous. <laughs> that was insane. <laughs> I didn't even know what was going on for a second. It hit it so hard.
Oh. Dang. That actually could have been one. Because how fast that strike was. That was a fast strike. Or it could have been another species of fish. Could have been a bass. That was a pretty fast strike though. That was fast and hard. <laughs> I'm not very good at catching snakeheads. If we want to get in there, we're gonna have to paddle. That was a prayer. I would definitely ambush right here. It's like the perfect ambush spot. Oh my, wow. He probably ain't gonna come back. Nope. Oh my God, that thing was gigantic. <laughs> wow. So determined to catch one of these things, especially after that top water explosion. Wow. Come on, Snakey. You're Snakey, Snakey, Snakey. Nope. All right, I'm gonna call it for the day. I'm, I'm pretty hot. Uh, did catch a couple bass a day um, using a swim jig. Originally started the day out just trying to catch some snakeheads. Um, not really that great at snakehead fishing as of yet. Uh, still kind of learning. Did learn a little bit today as far as like how shallow these fish actually will go. Uh, they actually will go pretty, pretty shallow, that's for sure. I mean, I'll actually show you. So, literally, that's the bottom. If you're a shallow water fisherman, this is about as shallow as you're gonna catch massive fish. Um, earlier, I had a pretty nasty top water strike. I, unfortunately, it scared me more than anything. Um, I really, I mean, I set the hook, but I mean, it was out of fear. I was just like, I don't know, I wasn't expecting a fish to explode on my, my little frog in that shallow of water. I mean, that was just, that was crazy, that was, that was awesome. I can see why people actually love to catch these things and hopefully I'll get better at it and learn and I'll have to go out with a couple of the people from my league and you know basically learn how to catch these fish because I've only caught like maybe one or two before and it was just by accident. It's not like I've went and actually targeted this fish um, for a long period of time. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please um, don't forget to hit the subscribe button below. And also, if you could just give it a like, uh, leave a comment as well if you like what I did. 
And if you like some of my other videos, and if there's anything that I can do differently, then just let me know. All right, till next time.